Hi, I'm Random Jaguar, and this is my friend Roberto Sarcido. Hey guys. And today, we'll be doing a Q&A. And for all behind scenes looks, bloopers, and anything else, check my channel for that after the Q&A. And then I'll put the description down below. So, let's do this. And hello. You're not even my video, but who cares? I'm taking over this channel. I'm just kidding. Um, I'm right here with Jamie. Like he said, we're doing a Q and A. I'm asking the first. I'm gonna do. I'm asking the first question. It's for both of us. And what is our favorite music? Jaguar. Well, I like any kind of music. To be honest, I like. I like rap, R and B, EDM, which my most favorite. I like rock, corridos. I like all that stuff. As long as the lyrics are good, not bad. Like not not bad lyrics. Like get away. <laughs> Um, right. Mine, right. I would say any because I like any kind of music. If I like it, I like it. I'm not just Mexican music, I like mariachi music, I grew up with it. Especially when you're Mexican, and in the weekends you hear that music playing, that music clean your ass, you have to wake your, you wake your ass up, and clean your ass um, I like any music to be honest. Um, EDM, I don't know how to pronounce it, but whatever. I like any kind of music. If, it, if you like it, that means I like it, to be honest. Next question. Alright, what is your favorite food? Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I have to nail for 500 to 5,000. Fuck it. Damn it! Oh, it's not. Oh, I don't know. I'll say. Ah, oh, damn, that's hard. Like, what's your type or is my favorite food? Um, let's go with type. Oh, type. Damn. I want to say American because that shit is fucking good. They got the hamburgers, the pizza, the fucking hot dogs, the steaks. Well, to me, any kind though, basically. It's the same thing like music, any kind. Because um, I grew up eating Mexican food. And every Christmas is tamale season. Fucking tamales every day, all day, every day. Even, fuck, even as a snack, you get tamale. But. To be honest, my sister-in-law, she makes a lot of good food. She makes Italian food, a couple Chinese. My dad can make Chinese food here and there. To be honest, I like any kind of food. How about you, Jaguar? Yeah, well, I grew up with Mexican food also. And I guess my most favorite is Chinese. So I like to eat food with peppers and onions and all that. And the veggies. That's what I like from like my like, um, pastas. Oh, I love yeah, the veggies. Well, I guess, I guess that's my most favorite. The second is Mexican, and the rest is whatever. It's sad how you put your nation blood second after the fucking Chinese. I know, I, I like to use some veggies, I don't know why. No, me too, I like veggies, <laughs> I like veggies anymore. Yeah, I like Chinese too, so, yeah. Oh, I love Chinese. Yeah. Alright, next question. Uh, what's your favorite shoes? Wow, this is a hard one. Oh, man. I just I just started liking bands. I know they're cheap, but it yeah. looks nice though, cause like I remember I remember seeing your videos, your Christmas video. You got these white bands, right? They look nice. One well, thing, they're white, so they they get dirty fast, no matter what. But ah oh, man, I, the last time I tried bands were it was maybe when I was ten. I've never tried it because I would always be Nike, Adidas, or any small company like Fila, Puma. But oh, it's my favorite? I mean, it's hard to be honest because everybody right now is trying to go for Jordans, man. Jordans are expensive. My burn on, he bought his son, which is barely, barely a year. Can you hear this? A year and two months, right? He bought him Jordans worth of 75 bucks, man. I'm like, God, motherfucking damn, this kid is spending more, got more shit on him than me. Well, no, but to be honest, I'll say, say Nike. Because I grew up with Nike, all the gear I had was Nike, so Nike would be mine. How about you, Tyler? Mm, yes, I really don't know. I'm a, I'm a person you guys to be honest I like any kind of shoes <laughs> like the ones I, I wear the most usually is, is some 
Vans, Nike. You won't see me in Jordans much, trust me. <laughs> and the fourth will be Puma, and the fifth will be Adidas. That's right. Like, I heard the Yeezys are very, like very comfy, but yeah, I'm not sure. <laughs> but we live in the desert, you don't have Yeezys yet. Oh, Yeezys, oh, I just oh, sorry, I heard of seeing them. They're like the Roshis of Nike, but like Adidas, right? Yeah. yeah I love Roshis, <laughs> Roshis are nice. Well, I guess my most favorite would be, I guess, Nike. Because, like, the shoes are really comfy and all that. And, um, I like to walk with the comfy store. Like, Vans, I know Vans are, are like, kind of small, but to me, it's so comfy. So I think with Vans that when you're like a big, not a big person, but we have white feet, I think you have to get like another size shoe than you think you are because I remember when I first got the Nike staple ones, like the just almost everybody has right now, like the low ones. Like for white people, I think you have to get like another size because it won't, it won't fit your size because it will be like two on the size would be like two, like I don't, don't want to say it, but like too narrow. There we go, too narrow, and it won't fit you that much. Like you think you do. But like Nike, they get you right. Anything? So, you want next question? Mm, yeah, next question. Yeah. Alright. What is your favorite drink? Oh, sweet. Oh, sweet. Oh, right now, I'll say brisket because I love their blueberry slash, I think, lemonade thing, but. It, I don't like drinking soda that much. I stopped drinking soda when I was maybe mm, sophomore year. I don't drink it that much like I used to do. We're not be drinking a lot of orange juice. Not apple juice, but like orange juice. Brisket. Arizona. Sometimes the circuit case slushies. So it's just her next dance. You know, we're not getting sponsored by the KMS. Yeah. Yeah. I wish we did, man. Oh, but no, I think that that's all because energy drinks I don't drink that much either. Uh, somehow I get I get enough energy by just sleeping like 24 hours. But yeah, how about you, Jaguar? Um, from Mexican drinks, my most favorite is chocolate. Oh man, I forgot to include that shit. <laughs> I didn't even think about Mexican drinks. Man. Second, American, of course. Get away, Arizona. I get away too. So somehow to me it sounds like an ice cream. <laughs> Raspberry ice yeah, cream. Get it now, stores. Okay, so next question, next question. Oh, baby, sports. Okay, if you're Mexican, doesn't matter if you're Mexican. Your favorite sport has to be soccer. Mine is soccer all the way. Well, soccer and wrestling. I grew up on my dad's side watching wrestling since I was a baby watching wrestling. Those two are my favorite sports, man. Uh, right now, I still play soccer. I play the soccer team, my friends, here and there. But yeah, I say soccer and wrestling. I grew up watching wrestling when I was a little kid, like I said. I think my first time, my first ever wrestling gear was when I was five, when my dad brought me wrestling shoes. I was to train with my cousins from Mexico, not from Mexico, but they used to live in San Diego, and they were right now the wrestlers too, still wrestling, but in the independent scene, like small little wrestling companies, not in the WWE, who I wish. And but yeah, the, they, they they taught me how to wrestle, so basically I know I got all my learning from them. That's all. Yeah. How about you? Well, 
I used to be a, I used to be a, a wrestling freak. I used to. But to me, wrestling, wrestling is like dead now to me. How can you say that? I'm just being honest because almost, almost all of the good wrestlers are gone. What do you mean all of the good wrestlers are gone? Ray Mysterio is gone. Nah, he's not gone though. He's just a. Bro, he's not gone, gone, gone. Nah, he's he, not he dead. Just to, he, he's, the way you see that, he's like he's dead. No, like he's gone, like in WWE forever. Like he's in Triple H, not that. No, he's in. No, he's in Triple H. No, no one could be a Triple H. I'm not sure. I'm not into wrestling. I'm not a face. So, first of all, soccer. Then my most second favorite. Peter. He's wrestling, he's a wrestler. You walk in there and you're wrestling. Alright. My second is anime. I love UFC. The fight from Ronda Rousey when she lost. That was a bad knockout. Oh, yeah. I can't believe that. First time, like, I was, I was like so hyped for her to like to win. But when she got knocked out, I was like, oh my god. Like, when she got knocked out, I actually felt the, the pain in my neck. I was, I was like, oh my god. That's a thing though, because watch. <clears throat> Cause in the MMA, I know there's a wrestler right now, Brock Lesnar, he's the worst in the MMA. And he is not a little even. Well the thing is that with him, when I see him doing, when I see him wrestling, like he take, I don't know why, like, the show was almost scripted, I know from now. I'm old enough to know that, you know what, it's fake, yeah, but there's some parts like, going through the table is not fake. Going through certain stuff, like the table, getting hit by not fake. Right, you hear those shots, like man, and you will feel them, you'll be crying your ass off, but, like, Brock Lesnar, like, he takes his fight serious when he wrestles, like, especially when they say, oh, you're gonna brawl with somebody, he actually punches him, like, no fucking doubt. Because he was in MMA, and, um, he got, he got punched in the head, so he might be, like, he might still have that addiction. Yeah, but still, you have to take it a little bit seriously. Almost everything is scripted, scripted and everything to it. So, what do you think? Favorite stories. Oh shit! Oh, who's my favorite story? You go first. Oh, no. All right. First of all, I like I like going to the mall when I have money, of course. Who the fuck knows about what and no money? Does that make you think, oh, I'm gonna buy this, and yet you have no money, you're damn hungry? True. Well, usually when I go to the mall, I have money. But this year I didn't have money, because I don't have money at all. <laughs> when was the last time I went to the mall, man? Well, um, when I walk into the store, to the mall, <clears throat> like, the first, the first store I go to is the Apple store. I'm an Apple person. And, um, I like to mess around with their computers, their iPad, and I like to do things. And also, I, I asked him about the, the about the, about this product and that. And then after that, I go directly to the to the shoe stores. Uh, who doesn't go to the shoe stores? I go to Finish Line, Shoe Palace, Journeys, and I guess that's about it. And also, <clears throat> like when I'm hungry or something from the mall, I just have, I just I just get like a, like a like a like a tea or water. And then when they have like 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 a snack there, I just get like a I call it um, a granola bar. That'd be awesome, of course. And also, I like to look at glasses like Oakley's, Cara, and all that stuff. And I guess that's about, I guess that's about it. What about you, Sarsipo? Uh, man, I think... So my first stores, to be honest, are like... Um... Let's see, Burlington... The mall, too, but I haven't been in the mall in a long time. But, um... The new store I opened over here, though, yes, says The shoe store right there. No, it's the shoe store. When I, each time I go to Burlington, they have brand Cone like Nike, Reebok, Adidas. And that store has, and it's really, really cheap. Really, really cheap. I know that. Um, let me see. Let me see. I don't, I don't go that much to the mall because one thing, I don't have money to go to the mall. But each time I go, I hardly go. Cause like, the last time I went out there was the beginning of the school year. Never gone since then. 
But that's all. Um, I wear glasses too, but right now I'm not wearing it because I only went to like only for school. But here and there I go on to, um, to check my glasses if I can use new glasses or anything like that. But yeah, I think that's my new, my favorite stores because I don't do that much. Oh, get yeah, GameStop. You forgot GameStop. I used to love I used to love GameStop, you guys. Damn it. Damn it. God damn it. Oh no, yeah, that's all I think it's in. That's all. Because if it's like a. Like a. Like one of my friends, we usually go to McDonald's, Taco Bell, Roberto's. Any of you that are outside Nevada, Roberto's, and like your. I don't know what. Candy or whatever. But it's a Walmart place. Damn, let's see. That's all I think. That's all. That's all my friends say, okay, it's okay. I'm gonna say, um, What is your favorite game? That'll be a hard one. Mm -hmm. uh, well, to me, not that much. Because I grew, I grew up playing soccer, like I said, around the so I'm always to give the word either FIFA or WWE. Right now, I'm trying to get an Xbox One. Try to get Call of Duty and GTA, but GTA is a beast. Online is way better because you just fuck around with stupid ass people that don't know. Oh, it's, I think it's, it's funny. I say, I say, G, no, it's hard to say video game names. So I'll say FIFA and um, Billy. How about you, Jaguar? Um, I'm gonna go back in time. Like, you know, my first um, video game was the game. Uh, like just off wait, wait, I'm not folding, right? Yeah. I had one. I had a, I think I want to see what consoles I had. I'm sorry to interrupt, but my console up here right now I have an Xbox 360. I had the old Xbox, the original Xbox One. I had a PSP, a DS, a Game Boy, Nintendo 64. Nintendo 64 is so beast, especially my friends where I used to live. I remember, every, not every night, but every Friday night, we used to like, get McDonald's, hang out my place, at, and they stay and they stay awake at like 2 in the morning, play Super Mario Party, or whatever game, because Nintendo 64 was a beast. Kids these days have iPhones, like man, if you don't know the games back then, those are the real games. Those are, now I'm saying the real games, they're, they're like the games that you are, yeah, we stay up all night. Like growing up. Mm -hmm. That was the that was the addiction. Mm -hmm. The Pokemon was the addiction too. Wait, the the training the training card thing like Pokemon cards, Marvels kind of games too, or you like video games? Mm, doesn't matter. Cause I remember in Man Tree, man, there was a phase. First it was Marvels, then my fifth grade or fourth grade year it was Pokemon cards. Man. I remember doing, like, people would go to school early just to play marbles in the grass. Like, it was a certain amount of hits, and you get it, boom. It has to be, like, continuous, I think. That's all. Okay, that's all? Wait, what's your favorite artist? Wow. Oh, yeah, I never finished my... Oh, oh my God, I'm so sorry. That's all right, though. <laughs> well, like I said, let's go back in time with, with the Game Boy Advance. Mm -hmm. My first game was the, I think it was, uh, I think it was Harry Potter or Pokemon, I can't remember. Well, my most favorite game that was, I was addicted to the, from the Game Boy Advance was Crash Bandicoot. Crash Bandicoot? Which was that one? It was an orange animal thing. Oh my god, that game! Oh my god, oh my god I remember playing that game on the PlayStation 1. Oh, and that fucking little mask guy used to follow you around? Yeah. Damn, I forgot about that one. Okay. <laughs> and then after that, I got, a, I got the, 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 the Nintendo D, DS when it first came out. The first game I got, I think it was... Well, I, thought, I can't remember the game, but I was so di I was dying to get the Mario's, the Mario games. <laughs> But right now, that was back then. And that, then after that, I got out of the PSP. The game, the, the most game I was addicted to it was 
One, Dexter. Two, my most favorite was Yu-Gi-Oh, of course. Oh, who did you like your mother? And after that, I got a PS3, the, the old school version, that the one that you play PS2 games. <laughs> one time I was playing it, and uh, it, it died on me. I was so sad. So you use okay? No. That was, no, it was the old school version. Oh, the old fat one? The, the, yeah, the one that said just, it's the one that said PlayStation 3. Oh. But the games I was, I was, I was addicted was... GTA, Call of Duty, uh, Sonic. I was a huge, I was a huge Sonic freak. Like my most favorite game from Sonic was Sonic the Hedgehog, and and also Dragon Ball Z, of course. Damn. 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 Then I got my PSG Diamond. I was so sad. Then I got a Wii. I got my, I got the Mario games. That's pretty, pretty fun. And I had the, and I sold the Wii. I got the PS3 again. And right now I'm not a gamer like I used to be. I'm just totally my focus on making music and videos for you guys. Well, I guess I'll be it for you next. Next question. Uh, favorite artist. Uh, oh, this is hard for me. Uh, I'm gonna skip that question. Do you want to take that question? Alright. <clears throat> From Corridos, I like, I like Gintai. The longest, the longest in the ocean group. Second from EDM, my hero, Tiesto. He's one of the only one who's done this thing. And three, R&B, The Weeknd. From Rap, I just started listening to Chicano Rap. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go with Mr. Criminal. Isn't that what? Oh, yeah, one thing to say. What you want to do is up to five, right? Yeah. And Drake, of course. From 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 rock. I I grew, I grew up with rock during my third, fourth, fifth grade year. Blah 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 blah. blah. Like almost everyone was Guns N' Roses and Mana. Yeah, they're a Mexican rock band. They're still around, but they don't play like rock anymore because they're old. They've, they've been around since, since the 70s and, and they're still around. Well, cool. Who the fuck is that play rock now if you're from the 70s? Shit, they be all wrinkly and shit. Yeah, but they still got it. <laughs> Alright, next question. Favorite thing to do? Sleep when you're in high school. That's a thing. You should be on your normal list. Sleep. If it's not. I'll say sleep, um, playing soccer, trying to make YouTube videos on my channel, uh, think of videos I want to do, that's all. But, so, I'll, I'll say, 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 I'll but yeah, I didn't have my favorite things to do here in Las Vegas. Nothing else to do here in Las Vegas unless you go to the ranch or go home. This trip. Man, that's fine. Wait, you mean the strip? You mean the strip club or just the strip? <laughs> what else? I, we're not even old enough to go to the strip club. <laughs> Alright, I find you. I probably strip. Alright, well, my favorite thing to do is going to the mall. And then I'm going to the <laughs> I had to, um, I had to go to, I love to go to the movies. <laughs> then I like, then um, I go to, I do some friends with you guys, like California and all that. Usually I, I just travel to California, because almost the rest of my family lives over there. But the rest of us in Mexico, but we had a problem with, with my family in Mexico, so we won't be going to Mexico for a long time. And, I, lo I love to listen to music, like, when, when, when my favorite artists come, people come here in Vegas, I will, I will like, try to go to their shows. I usually, usually they play in clubs. That's the thing I, that's the thing I get to though. Oh, yeah, man. Because, right now, I'm a DJ, 
I'm trying to I'm trying to be famous. But right now I'm starting with YouTube first. Well, I guess that would be it. Next question. What should the, ask this, question. This is the final question. What brand of headphones do you like? Headphones. Shit. <laughs> okay, I want to say Beats, but I don't have any Beats. Uh, I don't even, I don't like headphones that much to be honest. Because I just like earbuds. Because to me, they're just small. They you can just go in my ear now. I don't like headphones that cover my whole thing and just go on. I don't like headphones that much. We're about to pick one. I hope I get sponsored by them. Monster. They're nice headphones. They got. They have good headphones and everything. What about you? Well, my most favorite brand is first Monster, second Demoda, third Soul Republic. And last place will be Beats because I, I was dying to get Beats. My first pair of Beats, they died on me like for one month or three. Like when, like once I started working, the guys were still working. Then then I sold. I I, I um I, I got warranty on them, so I got new ones. Then I sold them. And then I got Monster headphones. Which is I fell in love with because yeah, the bass was strong enough. Because I'm not the bass person, guys. Like, when I went to the gym and work out, I had to do that bass. You guys know what I mean. And Vimora, Vimora, those are military proof. Like, they banned. I mean, I heard, I heard they, they could survive a bullet shot. I'm not sure. Then I heard um, you get like a sword or something, you don't want to like die. That's what they, maybe that's what they call military proof. And for earbuds, I go for Apple. Well, almost everybody's going for the Apple one, so. <clears throat> hey, think about it, almost everybody's going for the Apple ones. True, but they cost 30 bucks. Oh. Yeah. Fucking okay, Apple time to come But, if you go somewhere to sell them cheap for 10 bucks, mm -hmm. they don't last you long enough. Like, I bought the cheap, the cheap ones. Like, like the tip from the earbuds just like, like got removed, like, it just like a lot by itself. Well, I guess I'll be, I'll be able to you guys, just a, just a Q&A. Yeah, let me see. Uh, no, just, thanks for having me on your, I won't say show, but the channel. Thanks for having me on the channel, thanks for inviting me. Um, like you said, my channel will be on the Subscription, check me out. I just do daily vlogs. I'm gonna do about this vlog with this thing. And you know what? I'm gonna do that for you. I'm Roberto Sasio. This is Random Jaguar. And here you go. Eat. Peace.